morning guys um it's another day <laughs> welcome to another vlog um so yesterday i wanted to go northern lights hunting um and i did actually but the problem was like i already um like thought that it was way too cloudy all over iceland so um yeah i was i was actually northern lights hunting with a tour but it didn't happen so um we were we were going i think like north of Reykjavik um to Wellfjord. um we were driving through a tunnel i don't know don't ask me what the name was <laughs> um but yeah so we went there there was a first stop um there were actually less clouds than anywhere else um we could see the stars for a few yeah like maybe like 15 minutes um half an hour i don't know um but nothing happened and then the clouds came back and you weren't able to see anything else so we went to another spot um the guide um were was in constant uh, contact with um her colleagues um but they had the same problem and yeah then that wasn't good that another spot and then um we went to a third spot where it was actually even worse and then i came home at like um 12 30 a.m <sighs> so um i had none sleep and, and not that much sleep it's currently 6 29 can you see that Oh, it's 6.30 right now. Um, and I woke up like an hour ago. So yeah, I hadn't had much sleep. But it's fine um, because right now um, I'm off to um, Vic or not to Vic, to the south coast. Um, I'm going to tour the south coast today um, with a company called Fast Travel Iceland. Um, they were also the company I used yesterday. Um, and they are using like big buses, like um, the Nice Travel um, the, um, agency that I went with on the first day. They had like smaller buses, and this one has like huge buses. So I'm guessing um, it will be um, quite crowded on that tour because like the South is also super um, yeah popular. So um, yeah, I'm gonna tour the South and um, the glacier that is called. Um, I'm gonna write it here because um, it's too embarrassing to trying to pronounce that um, but yeah but that's a glacier where like all the pictures are taken here in Iceland like the icebergs are there um, from April I think until October you can actually um, do a boat ride on that uh, glacier lagoon but unfortunately I'm in here in March so it doesn't happen um, but that's fine I mean it's cold anyways um, and then we're gonna go to the famous black sand beach and to Vic which I'm very excited about so yeah I think it's gonna be a great day that is a tour I was most looking forward to and I'm so excited to see like all of those famous places and like yeah oh my gosh I'm so excited so um, I'm gonna go now and see you guys on the way. like so cool like it's icy here and there's the glacier how cool is that I mean oh my gosh just the way it looks in the camera it's like so amazing and I just love photographing it it's like so beautiful Stone. 
So I'm currently at the um, Diamond Beach. It's a black sand beach um, at the Atlantic Ocean. And like the waves are so high and even in Brazil they were this high. Um, I'm like so amazed that here are icebergs like at the beach. This is so crazy. Oh my gosh. Like look at this. How beautiful. Okay, so I'm currently walking from the Diamond Beach to the glacier. I'm not gonna pronounce the name because I'm gonna fail anyways. Um, but yeah, it's so beautiful here and we have like an hour left. So it's like quite a long time um, that we have here, which I'm very glad about. But like the snow is super glitchy. Um, so it's not easy to walk, but yeah. Oh my gosh, I can see the glacier look what I'm gonna show it to you. So it's back there. I'm gonna show it to you better when we're gonna move closer. Also, um, our guide said that this is actually a Banksy. Um, yeah, it's kind of, it does look like um, a polar bear without a hat. And it's kind of super old, that's why it's fading, it's from 2005. That's actually a Banksy, so I got a picture of it that's quite unique. Okay, now we're at the Glacier Lagoon. So beautiful, I can't believe it. Like, this is my first time seeing icebergs, or just being um, at near Glacier. It's like, I don't know, it's so unique to me. Like, I've been, I'm so used to like tropical beaches, but like, to this, this is like crazy. Um, here's the black sand beach and I'm about to walk there. I probably won't take any pictures or won't be taking any pictures of me because I just bought um, a skier and a coke and um, yeah it's kind of I was stupid I forgot my backpack and at the bus or on the bus it's um, there the orange one and yeah so I'm stupid, so I have to carry that stuff around. But, oh my gosh, okay, I'm already feeling the cold. Oh. Um, it's super cold. Oh, and I have no free hands. But I wanted to go to um, the Black Sand Beach because, like, it's big, very big, okay? I'm like, that's the Black Sand Beach. Oh my gosh, I wish I had more time here um, because we have only like 35 minutes. That's like not much, in my opinion, but yeah, I'm excited. Oh my gosh, we're in Vic. Okay, we're currently at Goga Falls, now we're just like Italian La Falls or something like that, um, behind me, where you can go behind the waterfall, but I didn't do that because. Oh, it's so freaking cold. Oh my gosh, I think my camera is oh, fogging up. I'm gonna go inside the bus now. arrived home um, that was an amazing tour but I'm gonna tell you more about um, it tomorrow in the next vlog because I'm super tired <laughs> it's like um, 9 30 or something and I had only like four hours of sleep last night and like a bit on the bus but nothing more so I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and I will see you guys tomorrow in my last Iceland vlog <laughs> oh my gosh I'm, I'm sad bye <laughs>